who is going to wrestlemania may as well be the tagline of the elimination chamber up next the 2024 dusty Rhodes tag team classic finals for monday night raw the number one contendership for the world tag team titles hangs in the balance angelo dawkins montez ford the street profits they are up and they want the smoke they want balor priest on the grandest stage the following is a tag team match set for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 492 pounds angelo Dawkins and montez ford the street profits the street profits rode the elimination chamber took them through the brawling brutes as well as the creed brothers and now they face off with one of the most legendary tag teams of all time jay and jimmy the usos but take nothing away from dawkins and ford they have held tag team championships all across the wwe and this dusty Rhodes tag team classic has been their ticket of resurfacing on monday night raw but can they ride this wave of momentum through the Elimination Chamber and all the way to AT&T Stadium in March? That is the question we await an answer to. Dawkins and Ford, all the tools to get through the Usos, all the tools to get through the Judgment Day and proclaim themselves tag team champions. But it is easier said than done. Street Profits, welcome to the USO Penitentiary. And their opponents at a combined weight of 493 pounds, Jimmy and Jay, the USO. After nearly two years away from World Wrestling Entertainment, Jay and Jimmy the Usos returning to Monday Night Raw three weeks ago as the eighth and final team in the Dusty Cup. Reigniting an old rivalry against Kofi Kingston and Xavier Woods of the New Day, the Usos were successful. The Usos took on the tandem of Elton Prince and Kit Wilson of Pretty Deadly in a first time ever collision this past Monday night and staked their claim in the finals of this tournament. Jay and Jimmy said they are back for a multitude of reasons. New competition to compete in this dusty tournament that they've never competed in, nonetheless won before. And they have also taken issue with the fact that the Judgment Day have proclaimed themselves the greatest team in Monday Night Raw history. But here we go, the Usos and the Street Profits. Here in Miami, Florida, Dawkins and Jimmy kicking things off. This should be one hell of a matchup between two extraordinary tag teams and as great as these two teams are, it is not going to be an easy task either way of the ring. When we get to WrestleMania and the Archer of Infamy, Damian Priest, the Prince Finn Balor are awaiting the winners. The Judgment Day, two-time World Tag Team Champions, as voted by you, the fans, your 2023 Tag Team of the Year. All those accolades seemingly go into the head of the Judgment Day obviously can make their claims to be the greatest tag team in Raw history, but there is a multitude of teams that will take issue. The Usos, one of them, the Street Profits, just looking to climb the ranks of the WWE and be able to earn that right one day. All remains to be seen. Fresh legs on both sides of the field as Jay comes in and meets Tez with a drop kick. Dusty Cup has been an awesome watch over the last few weeks on Monday Night Raw, and of course that is only the Raw side of the Dusty Rhodes Tag Team Classic. An entire SmackDown tournament begins this Friday night on SmackDown. That will conclude at WrestleMania. SmackDown crowning brand new WWE Tag Team Champions at the show of shows. Jey Uso, little style on that right hand to Montez Ford. The Usos looking to give the Street Profits a masterclass in tag team wrestling here tonight. Jay and Jimmy working like a well-oiled machine as they always did. Last time we saw the Usos, as we documented a few weeks ago, 
January of 2022, lo losing, I should say, their tag team championships in a unification match to Matt Riddle and Randy Orton, previously known as RK Bro. The Usos taking time away from the ring, felt that they did all there was to do, fought all the teams there was to fight. But new competition across all the brands in WWE, a dusty cup that they've never won nor competed in and a stake to claim their right as the greatest tag team of all time has brung Jay and Jimmy back to the squared circle in WWE. Make no mistakes about it. These two men, veterans of the squared circle, better than ever inside those ropes. Street Profits got no answer for the Usos thus far. This has truly been, as we said, a master class in tag team wrestling. The Usos in control here at Elimination Chamber. Turned away. There's a tag made to Jimmy Montez Ford rolling to the outside. Turned away the New Day. Turned away pretty deadly. And look at it turn away the Profits tonight. Jimmy Uso tagged in. Takes out Dawkins over the top. Takes out Montez Ford. The Uso showing why. They are without a shadow of a doubt. One of the greatest teams to ever step foot inside the ropes. Montez Ford in all kinds of trouble trying to get out of harm's way that time. In desperate need of creating some distance. And maybe that's exactly what he need. Sending Jimmy Uso over the top rope and Montez Ford trying to rally in Lone Depot Park. Oh, and a baseball slide. Slide into home base here in the home of the Miami Marlins and a crossbody over the top. Street Profits got to get back into this matchup. It has been all Uso so far. And there's another takedown by Ford. Montez Ford eyeing up Jimmy Uso. Street Profits are going to stick to their game plan, whatever that may be. Nice takedown again. Montez Ford trying to take the wind out of the sails of the Usos right now. I would say trying to slow down the offense, but if there's anything we know about Montez Ford as well as Angelo Dawkins is they'll push the pace with anybody. The big man of the Street Profits, AD getting tagged in. Jimmy Uso out of the way. Angelo Dawkins looking to be the difference maker for the Street Profits. However, Jimmy Uso is reading a different game book here tonight. Oh, wait a minute. Ooh. Look at him back it up, just like their daddy Rikishi. Down goes Angelo Dawkins. And one step closer to WrestleMania, but Angelo Dawkins still in this fight. Usos, a little bit of style, bringing their way to the Elimination Chamber. But the Street Profits did not come all this way to lose to the Usos. Second place trophies are not a thing in the Dusty Cup. It is first or last. AD muscling down Jimmy Uso. Great strength by the big man of not only the Street Profits, but of the match. And Jimmy Uso. Talking about looking like a car wreck in that no disqualifications match moments ago. Jimmy Uso collapsed inside of the ring like he just got in one. Angelo Dawkins now all over one half of the Uso brothers. And Dawkins once again sends him for a ride. I'll tell you what, Miami seems a little bit split between the Street Profits and the Usos, two fan favorite teams, but only one of them is gonna get their hand raised. Street Profits in control have turned this match on its head. The Usos were all over the Profits in the early moments, but Dawkins and Ford writing a different story. Jimmy Uso sent back inside and going for that signature splash, but Jimmy got the knees up. Homework was done. And looking to get an A on the test. DDT. And Jimmy in much need of a tag. Jey Uso in. But will it be a difference maker? Or is the Street Profits just in too firm control in this match? They are in the driver's seat right now. Tag made to Tez. Double team offense by the Profits here. 
working like a well-oiled machine, and Jey Uso sent for an amusement park ride over the top. Montez Ford, Tope Suicida! And Jey Uso doesn't know what hit him. Ford all kinds of fired up here in Miami, Florida. If you thought the Usos were the favorite coming into this thing, Dawkins and Ford looking to change some minds. Into the ropes goes Jay. Nobody home, double leapfrogs. Montez Ford quicker than a hiccup inside of that ring. Jay Uso got tagged in, hoping to be the difference maker, but it has not made a dent for the Street Profits versus the Usos. Jay is down, Jay is hurt. Montez Ford may be closer to the finish line than the Usos desired. Another tag made to Dawkins, and what do these two men have in mind? Wait a minute, little roll. Reversal that time. Big time splash by AD. And Jay Uso still into it. Usually it's Dawkins with the power move. Ford off the top. Desperate times call for desperate, desperate measures, and you got to strike while the iron's hot. Unfortunately, no three count, but damage certainly done. Jey Uso on spaghetti legs. Jimmy sent off the apron. AD could be closing in on victory here. Oh, could have been going for that tilt to world neck breaker. Jey Uso, however, read the playbook from a mile away. Jay trying to rally here in Lone Depot Park. Sends Dawkins into the ropes. Samoan drop. Jay doing what he does best. Over the top with a crossbody himself. The Usos have made a career of big time moments, making big time plays and big time matches. Will they do it all over again here tonight at the Chamber? I'll tell you what, these two teams not afraid to get their hands dirty going after the illegal competitors in this matchup. We've seen it on both sides of the squared circle. Dawkins getting Jay off his tail. Oh man, mean shot. And possibly a difference maker. Angelo Dawkins bringing Jay to his feet. Back into the ropes he goes. Jay is in enemy territory. Once again, we might see some double team offense here by the Street Profits. They are up. They want the smoke. And Jay Uso stealing the brunt of it. Shooting star. Go for the cover. That could be all she wrote. Montez Ford's going to the top again. Could be looking for a from the heavens elbow drop. Jay still alive. Jay Uso getting the shoulder up at two and a half. We have got a fight on our hands. The race to the finish line to become the 2024 Dusty Cup winners and another Samoan drop. Out of nowhere by Jey Uso. A last ditch effort by one half of the brothers, but can Jay capitalize on a weakened Montez Ford? Jay has got Ford in enemy territory. Off the Samoan drop. Tag made to Jimmy. Oh, wait a minute. Double team action from the legends themselves. One D. The 1D on Montez Ford into the cover. Will that do it? No, Montez Ford kicks out. Dawkins in there as well. 1D does not do it, but Jimmy Uso with an Uso splash. Exclamation point. That is it. That is it. The Usos are going to WrestleMania. The Street Profits took control in the second half when the Uso started out hot. But it ain't how you start, it's how you finish. Jay and Jimmy reach the finish line first. 1D, Uso splash, they're going to the showcase. Jimmy and Jay, the Usos! 
The Usos were back to remind the world just who the hell they are. The Judgment Day call themselves the greatest team in Monday Night Raw history. Well, now there's another team with a claim to fame. The Usos, Jay and Jimmy, are going back to the dance to battle for the World Tag Team titles. Coming your way on Saturday night, April the 13th, Witness the aftermath of WrestleMania as the superstars of Monday Night Raw and Friday Night SmackDown head to San Juan, Puerto Rico for the 2024 Backlash. This international live premiere event streams live at 5 p.m. Eastern time on Saturday night, April the 13th. And as a new season approaches, what will these superstars have in store? You haven't seen anything yet, and nothing can prepare you for the backlash.